Spooky, scary music, fun dip. <laughs> All right, y'all still hanging in there? Y'all still having a good time? Music down. All right, we just beat Resident Evil 4. We just beat it. Banger. Love that game, one of my favorite games of all time. And we're going to move on to something a little bit creepier, potentially. Something spooky, much scarier than Resident Evil 4 would ever be. Tormented Souls. Um, <clears throat> all right. I know nothing about this game. I watched like half of a trailer. And I was like, you know what? All right. Sold. Um, so I got it. Let's see, what, uh, let's see what the store page has to say <clears throat> about this title. Okay, good. Did not autoplay video. No, don't autoplay video. Um, classic survival horror is back. Bold claim. Bold claim. Inspired by the original Resident Evil and Alone in the Dark series. Maybe don't say the second one. Uh, Tormented Souls modernizes with a fresh twist on the fixed perspective adventure. Although, I guess Alone in the Dark didn't have like a... There was an older release and the newer ones are the bad ones. Anyways. Um... As Carolyn Walker investigates the mysterious disappearance of twin girls in a terrifying mansion turned hospital. So you got the mansion, you got the hospital, this game's got it all. Personally, I think it's it seems like more of a blend of the Resident Evil formula with an aesthetic that's a little more evil with any. That's what I'm kind of thinking. Original Alone in the Dark games are pretty good. So, I, all right, what I will say about the new Alone in the Dark games, well, new, they're still super old. It's like a decade old or something. Um, is it had a very cool inventory mechanic where you would look down and, like, open up your trench coat um, and, like, had slots for all of your, like, resources and stuff, and you could visually see everything. I thought that was very cool. That's kind of the only good thing you can say about that game, though. <laughs> Everything else about it sucked. All right, let's play it, though. I don't have a scene set up for this, so I'm just going to use the Resident Evil 4 one again. And if we have to move chat, we have to move chat. Spooky! If I have to move any of these visual elements, we'll find that out together. It also might need to do, like, the first time setup, direct direct stuff. Maybe. No, we're just in it. Just in it. Give it a moment to pop up on screen. There we go. All right. I also don't know how loud this is going to be. I've done zero testing. All right. Scenes of explicit violence and gore. That's a little loud. We'll fix that. I'm going to pick your nose. Pick your nose. All right. Uh... So I'm going to crank up the brightness a little. How, how do Ah, uh, okay. Oh, God. All right. It's a little, it's something. Um, V-Sync we definitely want on. All right. General. Go back to brightness. Can I? W-A-S-D. There we go. I'm going to crank up the brightness for y'all at home. Good. OK. 
Okay. And sound. 70%. Violence and gore hype. Let's stick it at 70, and then if it gets outrageous, sometimes cutscenes in these kind of like independently developed games aren't affected by these settings, but we'll find out. All right, I'm also getting like Dead Space vibes, and Alice Man is within. <laughs> I don't say every game I've ever played, <coughs> but you know what? We have a, a pneumatic nail gun, a skirt, and a leather jacket. There's a lot going on here with this character, and I'm very excited to find out what her deal is. So let's let's do that. Thanks, Luke. Go. Cheers. I can't save it yet, Luco. I can't do it. I I'm gonna good posture though. I'm gonna unfold the turtleneck. So it's going to be full turtle. Full turtle all neck. Oh, it's so long. Who has a neck this long? I mean, look at this. Look at this. It can go up my ear. Oh, that's so loud. Look at this. It's so long. A letter for me. I go. never receive letters. <laughs> Luca. I'm working on it. A little font paragraph thing. That's cute. All right. I feel like I've seen this exact asset in a game before. Also, wow, it really... Okay, it takes a little bit of getting used to. From John Doe. Uh-oh. Wild Burger. Dude, hit me with that Wild Burger. Add a little bit of cheese on there. No shredded lettuce. Thank you. Uh, Winter Lake, Blackwood Island, Canada. All right. We're also in Canada. Uh, interact. Do we have to rotate? Interact. Now that. Okay. Photo. It's a photo of. You just think you can abandon us here? Well, that's not ah. ideal. Oh, that's loud. Borger. Borger? Yeah, I got that. Okay. <clears throat> We're going to have to uh, bring the volume down a bit. Here it's we go. Two weeks since I received Cut that scene time. The Ooh, I'm in the... Since hang then, on. I, haven't been I don't want to hit escape. I can't get out of my head the Sorry, those my UI things. elements are in the way of the sleep. subtitles. And when I am able to fall asleep... It's only to dream horrible nightmares. I need I don't to know what's escape, going though. on. What's Bob's Burgers. This? I'm going to the Wild Burger Hospital in hopes of finding some answers about this strange photo. <clears throat> Welcome to I Wild Burger, to homo the Wild Burger. May I take your order? Yo, here we are. Here we are. That's us. Luco! <laughs> You're driving me nuts so. Oh, we're just going right in. What is this outfit? What is this outfit? You was passing out candy? Well, it's perfect timing. We just started. It's so loud. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, fuck. Well, shit. Too many children. Oh my god. I could not be in that neighborhood. Oh, sorry. It's very loud. I'm sorry. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. All right. Yo, we, uh, got a little nudity. Got a little nudity. Sorry, everyone. Uh, <laughs> didn't know boobs were in the game. I'm sorry. 
she'll just pass gas like the rest of us. <laughs> I was not aware this game had nudity. I apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Marco Meg. Booba. Booba. Okay. All right, hang on. Uh, sound. Holy shit. Like 50%. Thank you. Okay. Should I be playing with the controller? We'll find out. All right, I can't save it yet, Luco. I just can't. Oh, tank controls. Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, Taters, I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry you were ill-prepared. What did they do to me? All right, I do need to shift my dumb face over, though. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Webcam. Whoop. You know what? I think we can get away with... Ooh. Getting a little bigger there. Yo, I'm, like, mad pulling off... Like, this is Tim and Eric vibes with this turtleneck. <laughs> uh, anyways, happy Halloween. Let's make that smaller so it's not in the way of the subtitles. Beautiful. We got spooky cobweb up in the corner. That's all good. I'm Yeah, so I, I had the turtleneck on uh, when I was wearing Leon's jacket earlier. This is actually, this is the turtleneck I wore when I was playing Metal Gear Solid 4 in my, uh, in my snake costume. So I just, I also wore it for the Leon thing. Okay. Respirators and stuff. What's going on here? Yeah, why were you connected to the respirator? They were pumping in some badness. Oh boy. Mirrors in horror games. It, it's never something you want. Is her eye gone? Uh, yo, that's not good. Oh, the close-up, even. Uh. Yeah, maybe taters. I need to see what, like, all the actual UI elements are. That's bad. That's not what you want. There's some nice animation on, like, the clothing and stuff when she's moving around. This game doesn't look terrible. Huh. <laughs> what? Luca, what are you even talking about? Uh, shit. <laughs> okay, bye, Luco. Bye. Um, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, maybe Happy Halloween should go up top. Whoop. There we go. <laughs> okay, bye, Luco. See ya. Have a good one. Ooh. Oh. Nothing. Oh. William Wildberger's Diary. Okay. Hey, happy Halloween to you too, Luco. Adios. Um, I thought I wouldn't be able to believe anymore. All this time, I have refused to let hope grow inside my chest. But now that Maria is pregnant again, I'm going to believe again. For Maria. For those little souls. For me. Okay. Good for you. Today's the happiest day of my life. After all the suffering we've endured the past few years, Maria, my beloved wife, has blessed me with two beautiful angels. Okay, these are the twins. Um, but there's more. After all this time, she has returned to me. She looked at me with her eyes wide as if she had not seen me in years, like she was waking up from a dream. That's not all. Something odd happened when I checked my watch to find the exact time at which the first baby Emma was born. As I opened the lid, the glass cracked and the hands utterly stopped. I do not think this event to have meaning to have some meaning or other. I'm not a superstitious man, but Maria insists that it is a sign. She started using the hour as her lucky number and use it, uses it for everything. 
Okay, when were they born? Uh, what's the hour? I don't see it. Because if she uses it for everything, it's going to be a password. Does it say? Yeah, it doesn't say what it is. So, once we find out, we'll know. Is there nothing there? Oh, here we go. Ooh, with blue jeans. All right, someone else has been here. Can't interact with anything, so. Okay. Oh my. Okay. Fine, my heart's beating great. Resources. Oh, we have different costumes, okay. Photograph the twins, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very good, okay. The pocket watch, we're about to find out what time they were born. You got a clicky. Okay, I thought it said the glass cracked. Um, all right, well, the hour is 12. <coughs> like 12.35. So let's remember, 12.35. There's a latch on the ground, yeah, okay. Little baby, old photograph of two young twins. Oh. Time stood still and my two angels fell from heaven. Ah, oh, that's cute. Clicky. Click. Okay. All right. Do we have that now? All right, we got it. Okay. Okay, well, 12, 30, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. That's what it is, right? Mm. One, two, three, four. That's actually pretty funny if that's it. I didn't realize that. Yeah, it's 12, oh, 1235, sorry. Doink. <clears throat> One, two, three, four would be very funny. <laughs> All right, uh, we have a padlock, cool. And we have a fucking wrench. The jaw size is adjustable. Oh my, we're gonna have to adjust it? Okay, fair enough. All right. Uh-oh. Do not let shadows embrace you. Stay out of the dark. Instructional sheet. Oh, here we go. See, they have... That and an X is probably... Oh, okay, shift. Space is something. Okay. Right. I was like, telephone booth? <laughs> I don't know. All right, shift is run. All right, let's get, a, get the hang of this. We're looking good. Moving good. We're great at this. Um. Uh, let's examine it. There we go. And use it. Boink. All right. Nailed it. <clears throat> We're going to do just fine here. All right. Uh, don't let shadows embrace you, so probably don't go that way. What do we got going on here? Okay. Weird toilet seat. Yo, I need that fucking chair. Look at this chair. <laughs> I need that chair for gaming. Oh, hello. Oh my, this is bad. Okay, thanks, baby. Little baby doll. Where are you? Okay. All right, it's fine. Can I light this lamp? Uh, space, resources, equip. Oh, uh, okay. Very cool. Here we go. Man, 
and we're good at this. Also, this sucks. <laughs> I don't like this at all. I guess we're going this way. All right. Some sort of a fuse box. All right, that's the way to leave. It's over here, though. Appears to open electronically. Okay, okay. Weird that that would be inside the floor, but okay. Does this have, like... This is a thing where this has limited... Probably not, right? Ooh, cool helmet. Is that a map? Hell yeah. Take it with us. Ah. All right, we're there. Okay. So there's a pharmacy that needs something, some kind of key. <laughs> So we, from here, we can go downstairs or up two different ways, I guess. Is that the, That's the downstairs that's blocked off. So we're coming from the south end of the building. Or no, we came from the north end. Got it. Okay. All right. This takes a special kind of key. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's normal. Yep. Just real normal. Okay. Yeah. Huh. Whatever. Okay, good. We get to take it with us. Alright, yes, so we're in the East Wing Corridor. I get it. M for map? Hmm. Under files. Okay. So we're now here. We can go down or up. So we are heading north. We came from the south. Yes, yeah, so we came from the dentist room. No, the private restroom. Where did we come from? Where did we go, Cotton Eye Joe? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, okay. Up? Yeah, up first. I don't like basements, so we're not gonna go down there. Okay. Judith beheading Holofernes Caravaggio in 1602. The Syrian general Holofernes in his tent after charming him. Man, she does not look into it, though. She looks very confused. This recreation's outstanding. Almost like the original. Mm, okay. Now, does that update on the map? No. Okay. So we can't go up. There was another door back here that we could try before going into the horrid basement that I don't want to go into. Mm, not there. It was here. Which goes towards, like, the main hall and stuff. Yo, all right. Here we go. The waiting room. Of course. So we are now here in the waiting room. We just came through here. So we could potentially go into the examination room. Or into the dentist room. Or into the main hall. Let's find out. Ah! Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Handgun ammo. Clip of nails. Hell yeah. Better than a pistol. It's way cooler. Ooh. A report about the Tismuit tribe. According to the latest archaeological discoveries on which we're like, oh, oh sorry. The Tismuit tribe resided on the island for more than 500 years before being discovered by European settlers. Proof of this is an ancient underground cemetery found deep inside a cavern on the island's shore, dating from the 10th century. More than 286 skeletons belonging to 10-year-old children... 
have been unearthed so far in the underground cemetery. All the bones are buried in pairs, and experts suspect that these were twins buried together. Okay. That's lovely. Oh, I can't have any maximum soda? Ah. It's new, too. Come on, son. All right, what is this? It's, all right, another electronic lock. Okay. So, this door and that door are electronic locks. I wish I could mark that up. Ah! Uh, you piece of shit. Yeah, seriously. Ugh. Look at its torso. It, its arms are lower and smaller than they should be. Nothing about that doll is good. That's a bad doll. Okay, we're here now. The examination room. Oh, is this a safe room? Vial of morphine. Hey, oh. Is this, uh... Okay. Is this safe room music? Oh? Okay. Sure, I'll take that. I bet I'll need that later. This is half a plastic heart. Oh, sir. May I interest you in half a plastic heart? Oh, my God. Sorry, I'm yawning like crazy. Detailed mannequin of the human torso. I gotta have to combine it first. Alright, okay. What are you? Oh, this game. This game has those. So we cannot save whenever we want. Nothing interesting, eh? Oh. Oh. Not plugged in. Cool. I mean, the power's not on anyways. Can I not save until the power's on? I mean, I don't want to... I don't want to do that yet. I don't want to waste it. Oh. Yeah, don't lift it. I don't blame you. Okay. Uh, so, safe room. Safe room is examination room. And I guess it's got a little microphone for, like, recording information. Got it. Let's see if we can get into the dentist office from here. Let's find out. Let's walk around and find out. Oh, that doesn't look passable. Oh, but it is, but it is. <laughs> oh, no, my wrench is gone. That was a one use wrench. Bruh, highly uncool. All right, and that's electronic. All right, nowhere to go but the fucking basement. Damn it. Damn it. A lot of weird noises going on. A lot of weird noises. Uh, down the steps, I guess. Down to radiology. Okay. Heart attack is right. I'm impressed at the darkness of this game because my monitor is so blown out. Ooh, more nails. Yes, it can, can't it? How many we got? We have seven nails. All right, what do we got in here? Ooh, 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 ooh. We need that for the thing to go into the place. All right. Dr. William Berger. Since the patient's health is extremely de delicate and the transfer could worsen their condition, I would advise against transferring them to the new hospital. The patient has cardiac insufficiency. 
and requires an immediate transplant. I don't think they consulted a doctor when they wrote the script. The patient passed away at 11.34 p.m. due to cardiac arrest. At the time of their death, they did hold, they were holding on to a metal object. Okay. So the patient that died at 11.34 has the handle for this socket wrench. Got it. All right. I bet they're definitely not still alive somehow. Ah, wheelchair man. Wheelchair man. Hello. I'll go this way. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> See you later, wheelchair man. What the fuck is this? It's been... Why was wheelchair man doing this? What is happening? Wheelchair man? That's a weird statue. Drink of water. Better be quiet. Do not run. Slippery when wet. Oh, uh, what's here? What is this? What's here? Uh, I don't have a map for this area. Or is the map everything? Hmm. No, I can't. I think once I get more tabs. Sign you'd see at Walmart? Yeah. Alright. Power is this way. I would like that. I would like the power. Okay. That's not my favorite. Hamana, 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 hamana. Where am I going? Who can say? Oh my god. I don't. I don't like wheelchair, man. Hello. Hi. I like your Gore-Tex. <laughs> the hell's what going on here, man? What the hell is going on here? <laughs> Marcus, dear. My child, you are pale. <laughs> what happened to you? Nothing. A person in a wheelchair with knives in his hands was chasing me. Man, that's a crazy sentence. Oh, it's you. Don't you remember me? I'm the town priest. We met here in the chapel only a couple of days ago. Just, just ignore what she said. It's fine. What? I'm sorry. I don't I'm remember sorry. You. I'm I sorry. I certainly don't remember coming here before. I'm sorry. I see. Perhaps I'm mistaken. I'm old and get confused every now and again. What is going on here, Father? Where is everybody? The patients and the hospital personnel have been transferred to the new hospital in town. This old mansion has been left pretty much abandoned. This voice acting has, like, mad, um, I just had my sister do it vibes. <laughs> Why are all the lights off? I don't like this. Nothing against, nothing against that. It's fine. It's fine. I feel the same. Something evil is happening here. Something wicked that hides in the shadows. Okay. We should leave, then. Is there a way to turn on the lights? The old generator has been playing up. Playing it up? It happens sometimes. Go to the end of the hall and through the door that leads to the generator room. You can restore the power from there. Okay. End of the hall through the door that leads to the generator room. I see. I'll do that. Wait. Take this with you. It's not <coughs> much, but it might be useful. It's dangerous to walk around the mansion unarmed. What are you doing here, then? Why are you here? 
Leave! Go! Shoo! Thank you, Father, but what are you going to do without a weapon? My child, with a Bible oh, in my boy. hand, God protects me. Either he's behind it all, or he's gonna die immediately. Stools. <laughs> Stools. Alright. Power air. Yo. Stools. I'm all about it. Let's fucking go. Dude, you know I'm gonna pump some rounds into wheelchair man. Okay, we can't have... Oh. And... Okay. There's no real aiming. It's just kind of... Wherever you're pointing. Oh, here we go. So aim. Fire. And... Oh, you can like dodge and shit? Wait a minute. You, oh, there's a back dodge? Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Yeet. 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 That's fucking dope. Okay. Well, we don't need this right now. Let's uh, equip that so we can see better. That's hella dope. Yeah, it does look like the plasma cutter. Skirt! <laughs> How is this not the generator? Oh! Ooh, okay. Crowbar. I'm sorry. Not plugged in. Alright. It's over here. Oh, is this down the hall to where the generator is, I'm guessing? Uh. Uh. Why? Why? Why would those be here? All right, I have to crowbar. Let's use the crowbar. Nailed it. Take any of those nails with me? That looks like something. <laughs> Nailed it. All right, here we go. I'm sure all this is fine. Hell yeah. Wheelchair man won't even know what hit him. <clears throat> oh, something glinting over there. Uh huh. What's going on here? There's an issue with the electric generator. The pressure of the gas must be exact for it to ignite. The correct pressure is written on the control panel. Thanks, logbook. Uh, what? Okay, yeah, open. Very good. Nice. Nice job. Great job. Okay. We need to look at the control panel. We don't want to blow up. I don't want to go boom boom. Oh, boy. There's just a lot of places to go. Oh, here we go. Map of the area. Why can't we take it? It's fine. Here we go. Nailed it. Hey, there we go. Small valve. We're going to need that. Uh, no. 10 kilograms per centimeter. All right. <clears throat> Let's go do that. Let's get 10. All right. This boy. Missing one. All right, let's find out. Explosions are cool, though. You're not wrong. All right. That's almost 10. Okay. That's exactly 10. Nice puzzle. I mean, that was it, yeah? Roscoe, fuck off, bro. What are you doing, man? Don't do that. Man, he just runs up, and he puts a snout, and just fucks with your arm. Uh, that's the start button, yeah? 
Matt. That's 10 kg per send, man. Hmm. Hmm. Is it because it goes down when I try something? What game is the best story to me? Gameplay aside? I think that's the solution we're looking for. Um, best story. Rum, 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 rum. We did it. Okay, we don't. Uh, equip. Alright, I just have a feeling. Bad, this is gonna happen. Door's now unlocked. Ooh. Shit! Oh, fuck. I hit the wrong button. Hang on. Excuse me, knife hands. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. That's not the right button. Yeah. So what? So what? We're fine. We have 17 nails left. So what? That's what's up. Um, to answer your question, I don't know, man. That's such a wide range of things. Okay, can't go in the morgue yet. Not from that side. Is there... Uh, basement? Okay, the morgue was there. That door's locked. Okay, if we go to the main hall and sweep around, we'll be able to get there. Gotcha. Okay. Now that the power's on... Let's go see what's going on with our boy. Hmm. Yo, I got the power on. You want to, like, come hang out? There we go, let's reload. Boy, we used a full clip on that fool. Hey. You may find what you're looking for in the library. In the library? How can I find the library? It's on the second floor of the East Wing. Take the stairs in the main hall. Oh, you'll need okay. to unlock the door in the waiting room. Thank okay. you. Take care, Father. Okay. Are these, uh, can poopers working now? Why? Is there something? Oh, there's more nails over here. <laughs> Throw as many wheelchair boys at me as you possibly can. I ain't a furred. All right. Uh, that was not it. All right, we're, at, we're down at the end of the hall now. Okay. Okay. Uh, all right, that's the way we wanted. It's good. Okay. Uh, this is on now, right? There's nothing else back there. So we have the hex 
thing, but we need the handle, which is in the morgue. All right, we came up the stairs. We came up the stairs. We need to get in the main hall, so we have to unlock the door in the waiting room, which we can do now. Which we can do now, because it was an electronic lock, as was this one. So let's go in here first. Oh, hell yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Mm, maternity ward, not my favorite. Okay. Lucas Houston, evening shift, electrical maintenance, 1445. The nurses told me that a lamp was malfunctioning in the maternity ward. When I turned on the lights, I could see that one of the bulbs in the wall was indeed flickering. As I was getting ready to change it, a man came out of nowhere, grabbed me by the shoulders, pushing me back with strength unimaginable for someone his age. He told me not to touch it. I didn't want to argue with him, so I left. I can't stop thinking about it. Why did the old man prevent me from touching it? Okay, so a lamp on the wall. Got it. There's an issue with the electrical generator. The pressure of the gas must be exact for... Oh, oh okay, so it's all... This is from the same dude. Okay. And if she's just having a hallucination, shot a random guy in a wheelchair <laughs> with a nail gun, like, seven times until he died. <laughs> but would it really be her fault, though? Because she was getting drugged. It's full of various medicines. I guess none that we can use. Alright, this is all fine. Oh... Oh. Oh my. <gasps> the plastic heart. Doesn't fit. Oh no. Let's not let's not touch it. Let's not touch it. Water switched off. Fantastic. It's fine. I'm not thirsty anyways, damn it. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, right, but he's got the handle, and we need it. Look at it. The handle. Right, we're going to have to jumpstart their heart, so we need the other half of the heart first. Oh, my. This is not wonderful. Oh, we got another safe. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh. I'm sure nothing happens with that mirror. I'm sure it's totally fine and innocuous. Various mannequins are kept under these sheets. They're not going to move at all. It's fine. Ugh. Uh. I could light that candle, huh? Boy, imagine if I lit these candles. <laughs> Fucking ass. Okay. That's probably fine. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, what the fuck? What? What? She's gonna get pulled in. You should back away. You're voluntarily going into Mirror Town? Are you kidding me? What? I don't wanna be here. This is bad place. No. Uh-huh. Yeah, you did this to yourself. Oh, my. This is different. All right. Okay. Roscoe, do not touch me. I will end your life. Fuck you! 
Bye! Fuck that, dude! Are you kidding me? Torso boy? Are you kidding me? No way! Rasko! Bro! Go get mama! Go get mama! I need to text my wife. He needs stuff. He probably just wants dinner. He's mad about it. Okay. Holy crap. Is he just going to be right there? Let's, let's find out. Fact-finding mission. We haven't saved yet. Reload. Stay down, motherfucker. Okay. Fine. Oh, he's just a butt. <laughs> he's just a butt. All he has is a butt to his name. Oh, now I feel bad. Now I feel bad. I don't appear to be in good condition, you don't say. Hmm, oh, okay. It doesn't fit? Wet. Hmm. It's a hole in his chest cavity, no shit. Okay. I guess I need the other half then. Water switched off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh, stay away from the darkness. Um. Hmm. All right, can't open it. Fine. I'm okay with it. Uh. Need to force it. Crowbar. No. Okay. So I can't do that. All this stuff I can't do anything with yet. Alright. So... Nothing we can do... In the other dimension. So let's go back, I guess. That's fucking weird and wild. Is that big boy here now? Who showed up in the mirror? Um... Okay. Is there... The newborn room. Ugh. I don't know what C means. Okay, well, anyways. The other electronic door was unlocked. Uh, we don't need that. Out. We want that. Uh, out. Come here, little man. Okay. Reload. You can get up. What? Woo! We're fine. We're good. Okay. Creepy little boy. Don't like. Alright, wasted a couple shots there. That's less than optimal, but. Uh, the examination room is in there. That's where we save. What kind of... Okay, this is like blocked off. Okay. Probably didn't even have to fight that guy. Uh, Here? So we were in the restroom when we woke up. I don't think there's anything else in here for us. Okay. This is where we want. Oh, you should have. Messed up. Messed up, let's go. Fucking two of them? See ya. Bye. <laughs> Fuck that, are you kidding me? 
How's a girl supposed to fight too? we died we haven't had a chance to save it yet i was on my way to the save room yeah we didn't even have a chance to save it yet that feels pretty bad <sighs> i guess we should have taken the chance initially and saved it i don't know i feel like we were not equipped to handle two bad boys there that was bad news. Um, well. <laughs> I might, um, I might play back to this point. Because I was just going to go save and probably call it there. Um, just because I wanted to start this game and see what it was all about. Maybe I'll do this bit again on my own time. And we'll get to that save point. I'll kill those two dudes. We'll get to the save point. And then we'll start there next stream. That's my plan. That's my plan. We'll see if it happens. <laughs> um, <laughs> that feels pretty bad, not gonna lie. Um, but, you know, you can't win all of them, right? Uh, <laughs> sorry to end stream so abruptly, but uh, I would like to watch a spooky movie with my wife before we go to bed to celebrate Halloween. So I'm going to go do that. Um, I appreciate people coming out and hanging out. Uh, that game is frightening. It was pretty intense. Uh, the save thing is an issue. <laughs> it's an issue. But it's also a staple of the genre. So that's just kind of the way it goes. I will play back to that point on my own time. I'll save it, and then uh, that's where we'll pick up on stream next time. How about that? Um, thanks, everybody. I hope everyone had a fantastic Halloween. Have a fantastic rest of your Halloween and a good work week coming up. And uh, catch you all next weekend. Peace out.